how you mark, mark the space off on the floor? We did. To cut, I'm saying to get our measurements, we set it up. So I'm saying you don't need to keep the table in the spot? No. No. So hey y'all, hey, hey friend, hey. Girl, guess what? I'm back on your screen now. So look, listen y'all, in today's vlog, we will be doing a kitchen table DIY. Kitchen table DIY, okay? Look, listen, I don't know about all the products. All I know is I'm ready to play with the what, baby? The sander, which, which one? You like to play with all the tools. <laughs> <laughs> I want to sand and I want to use the, uh, is it epoxy? Oh, the epoxy. Yeah. And I want to play with the epoxy. That is what I want to do. But anyway, y'all have already seen us go to Home Depot to purchase like the wood we need to redo the table. Y'all already saw that vlog. So now we finally made it back in the kitchen because I just finished doing everything in the living room. I am hungry too, mommy. I'm hungry, baby. You want to make some bacon eggs? No, because we need the kitchen to stay clean. Yeah, just So anyway, uh, it's your girl Shawnell Lene coming to you from my new kitchen, our new kitchen, me and baby boss lady. Yeah. <laughs> don't be mad, don't hate, and don't be jealous. Okay. So look, listen. <laughs> oh yeah, we gotta paint that. So for real, let me quit playing all jokes aside. So as you can see, we have all of the products that we need. I promise you I will do my best to explain things y'all know they help me um explain but yeah those are all the products that we need minus this this is for the stove to clean the stove but yeah we got all the products we need to do this so yeah we'll be doing a marble top for the table and we will lay it on match it on the countertop we're just gonna get new countertops but baby we in DIY season baby don't play with us don't get it twisted and then we're also going to paint the towel we have found out we have done some research that we do not need to take this out we actually can paint the um towel the backsplash here so like baby it's diy season over here okay we getting ready so look listen y'all that's what we got going on right now and um yeah we already have everything set up we're about to prep but well, we're about to First, you know, paint. We had these before we did the makeover in the kitchen and I think we're gonna paint them. I think they should paint, cause this is where we had these originally. Then we're gonna paint them black. I wish this little distress can stay, but I doubt it. But anyway, oh, if I had a, let me shut up. <laughs> so yeah, that's what we got going on right now. Uh, so I'll just see y'all when we get everything together and when I turn this camera back on. <laughs> oh, I like that. Mm -hmm. Can it? You should do some strike. What strike? Like how some of that still showing through. I don't know. I ain't talking about nothing. Yeah. We can get these out the way so you can put them up. Yep. Yeah, Can you lift it real quick? Yeah. So hey guys, we're back on your screen. I'm sorry I forgot to record, but right now we are putting on the edge banding on the edge of the tabletop. Uh-huh, the soon to be tabletop. So that's what we're doing now. The direction says to just simply earn, earn, earn this on. Okay, earn. The heat from the iron melts the glue and causes it to adhere. Hey, hey, friend, hey. Look, listen, y'all. 
we are here still in the kitchen you know because it takes time you know what i'm saying you cannot rush perfection okay so as you all know we took the original table and bind it with the board you all saw us purchase from home depot then once we did all of that you all saw that we went in with the primer to prime to to prime the table and then we went in with what we thought was going to be our base coat which was the gray that we mixed together we took some black and white paint and we mixed it together to we came up with a desirable color that we felt that we was going to like however standing back in the kitchen different areas of the kitchen we felt like that gray top coat wouldn't work for us so now what we're what we are going to do we're going to paint on top of that gray coat and we're going to turn it black and we're going to build from that I think it'll be much better for us. I think it'll, it'll be more cohesive with, you know, all the black, the black appliances, the black sink, you know what I'm saying? Like it just will look better. Like when we stand back, it just feel like we just have a, a piece of something in here that does not match. Now, I will say this, we do not know if it's gonna look right with this coat. We just did not wanna take a chance. We're gonna go ahead and repaint this. We're gonna paint it black. I don't know how many coats we're gonna use today in this video. And uh, I don't know how long we gotta dry before I can, damn, we can't never get through this. Now we gotta wait for that to dry. But it dried quickly, remember? Oh, okay. Yeah, then we're gonna move into the rest of the DIY project for us the kitchen table we're going to try to do the veining we're going to try to marble the table versus you know what you usually granite. see huh granite. yeah instead of granite now however if veining does not turn out right we can always go back and we can um do the granite but one thing about marbling like i just feel like you really can't make a mistake in that but you still have to be careful on blotting it out and not smearing it too much you have to be really, really careful on that part. So I'm not gonna do a lot of talking. I'm just gonna jump right into this video really quick because I know that's why you clicked on play. So look, listen, I'll see y'all when I gather all my supplies and when I turn this camera back on. So, okay, y'all, I'm back on your screen. So we have decided to use a canvas first. <laughs> yeah, this is me practicing bathing like it. We're gonna paint this all black. And we're gonna go in with the different grace to see how that's gonna look. Now we are having second thoughts because this project or this DIY project has never been done with the base coat being black. I've seen it where they build up to black. So we're just trying to figure out what we're gonna do. And uh, I'm not really gonna record this process, but I will come back and show you all what it looked like with the base being black. Here it is in black. Pretty. It's very exciting. <laughs> and again, thank you so much, so much for all your comments and all your prayers. I have read each and every one of them. Each and every one. So, okay, y'all, we're back on your screen. Look, listen. We, we uh, practice on two canvases. This is the first one. This is the one my love did, boss lady. So pretty, can y'all see it? Oh my God, it looks amazing on camera, I love it. Wow. So cute. And then of course, <laughs> yours truly baby, bam, it won, it won. <laughs> now they quit. And this is the one that I did. So, y'all see it? Just show it for a minute without saying anything. Huh? Just show it for a little, little minute longer. Why? They can I see it. I want them to see it. That's all. Yeah, because it's pretty. No, I don't want to stand up camera. I've been to click off the video. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> for five minutes. Well, I was saying. I was saying. <laughs> Listen, everyone uh, voted on in the house. Everyone picked. Without knowing who did what. <laughs> right. Without knowing who did what, everyone picked this one, including myself. Before I even called everyone in to ask them which one they like, they picked this one. What y'all think? 
which is boss ladies and then this is my so i'm gonna try to do a really quick side by side we're gonna move on okay <laughs> yeah so which one do y'all like which one will be our kitchen table comment down below you can say you like it you can say you don't like it and you can give advice points and and tips keep in mind this only temporary we're gonna this is only temporary this is only temporary rip <laughs> Baby, <laughs> uh -uh. <laughs> yeah, this is only temporary. That's closer. <laughs> well, baby, say it. Temporary. Temporary. Okay, this is only temporary, and uh, I got it, baby. Yeah. Okay. And so, yeah, y'all pick down below. No, drop a letter C for Chanel, mm -hmm. and drop a letter B if you like the one boss lady. C or B. Baby, you did a great job. That wow. shit is so cute. It is so cute, baby. You did a great job. Yeah. That's not fair because this is actually what she does. She's a painter. I can go and pull out some paintings that <laughs> she's done. Okay? So I feel like I did a great job. And you not did. A, no, I said, no, honestly, for your first time, it came I together. Did. Like, I think that- I'm gonna show y'all some paintings too. And, okay, I'm sorry, I cut you off. We could have done this a long time ago, but we couldn't, we couldn't, we didn't have a vision. Yeah. You know what I mean? We kept thinking it was messed up, but for real, it was just like she said, it's a layering process. Yeah. And at the end, it came together. But yeah, okay. and with that being said, I want to show y'all later, maybe at the end of this video, some paintings that Boss Lady did, or maybe in another video. I don't know. But right now, baby, it's time for us to start working. Are you scared? I'm not scared. I, oh, what's that? Oh, my ear, my AirPod. I'm scared. I'm not going to lie. This DIY is very intimidating to me. Okay. Because we got to live with it for maybe about five or six months. Yeah. And then I'm not going to want to part with it. I know, right? <laughs> it's going to be so nice. Yeah, like, but because I'm excited about the... That's all right. Table we I think so. so yeah, I hope you all are enjoying these kitchen DIYs. Some things, as you can see behind me, we have things back on the wall. So you, a lot of things you all didn't see us do. But baby, I will be giving you all a full tour of the kitchen. And maybe before we can get certain pieces, we waiting on uh, to get certain more pieces for the wall. But other than that, I will be showing sure y'all. So y'all, this is our new kitchen table. So this is the pattern we're going to use. I got my coffee. Did y'all purchase y'all mug yet while we had it? We'll talk about that later. But don't forget to sh shop Sharice's Pieces that want Essie. And uh, yeah, get your magic mug. So look, listen, this is me. I got my breakfast. This is my breakfast. I have my coffee, y'all. So if I was sitting here at the kitchen table, talk to me. That's what your table would look like. This is what my table would look like while I'm sitting here. Okay. Y'all see it. Y'all see it. Don't miss it. Do you need a smaller plate? No, it's cool. We're okay. just trying to, because it's the I table show. see the table, yeah. So yeah, y'all see it. Don't miss it, baby. Don't miss it. So look, listen, we got to get to work. I really love this, baby. You did a great job. We talked too much. We don't want this video to be all okay. like that, okay? All right. all we all right. talking about all something. Right. We came to do a DIY for y'all, baby. Here is our new kitchen table. Okay. Oh, comment down below if you think we should leave it this shade or should we darken it to black? Because originally, the original table was black and it looked amazing in here. However, we've ch chosen to do a DIY. So, I kind of think it should go back I'm gonna to darken it a little bit more. But I'm gonna leave that gray, but I'm gonna darken it a little bit more. I love it. I'm gonna use these things on the wall. Put some more black veining in there. Some black veining. Mm -hmm. So anyway, come on nothing. Ooh, I could do this thumbnail. Thumbnail. <laughs> there you go. So, okay, y'all, we are ready to start painting. Again, like I told you all in the beginning of the video, we decided to go ahead and make our canvas black. So, that's what we're about to do now. Okay. Baby, I'm doing this right. Yeah, spread it out in all directions. So, oh, okay, because I want to say I can't move the page. I don't want it on the tape. And oh, you well. ain't even down here yet. And you might need some more. Okay, well, go ahead and put it on. I don't know if you do, I see you might. Oh my gosh. Baby, one thing about this is we're going to need only one coat, right? No? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure. We'll see. Okay.
Uh, one more question. It don't matter if I go this way or that way with it, right? No. But I do want it at the end of your painting, everything go in one direction. Okay. Yeah. Because I'm not good at this. You're doing great. Why? <laughs> Roll those beautiful beans. Because we're tired of doing it. Come on, that's because you need more. That's all. Okay. Let me see. Why you Let me keep pointing in the see. middle? But you can move it wherever you want to. Yeah. Well, for you can move it wherever you want to. <laughs> like that girl said when we were younger. Can you take me somewhere? Get my key because I can get in. Not so I can get in. Because <laughs> you know. I can get in. Right. Black to black, I'm loving it. Now we just leave it like this and put a glaze on it. Yeah. Okay. What edges? This? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to do that last. You know me, I don't know how to take my time doing stuff, so I'm like, I'll do that last. I wonder if they had a thicker board. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I told you to. Well, why didn't you get it? You don't listen to me. Well, why didn't you make me? Well, um, I think your thought, I don't know if you was thinking about the balance of the table. If we had it got it even thicker, which means it would have been heavier. Damn, I forgot to pull the table out. That's okay. Um, I, I think you made a pretty good choice of being what we have to stabilize it. You know what I mean? Then you dab it? Yeah. Mm. So hey guys, I'm back on your screen with a voice over. Look, listen, y'all. As you know, when you do DIY, sometimes you run into some hiccups, sometimes you mess up, and you just have to redo this thing all over. Uh, I'm gonna let this video go live, but I just wanted to come back on here and let you all know that. We did start it out doing it this way, but we have since changed it. But I still wanted to show you all, you know, some of our mistakes or show you all that you can start over even if you mess up because it's just paint and you can just paint all over it. Um, we started doing it with a sponge. We didn't like it, so we end up redoing the whole thing and we finally got the design that we wanted. You will not see that in this video. However, I did just want to come back on here and let you all know that we did not like it. And right here where you see um, Boss Lady putting using that roller to put that glaze on top of that, that glaze is to mute that gray color that you see on there. So every time you go on and you put your design on or whatever you do with your sponge, you go back over it with a glaze and then you blot it out with a dry cloth. So that's what you're seeing us doing here. The rest of the video is the same thing. So just enjoy and just know <laughs> it did not end up the way you're seeing it now. Hey, that's a bang. Oh, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> not yet. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, you need your so rag. So now we're going, huh? You need your rag. Oh, I need a rag or something. Cause remember, we got to. Why you say you ain't get your stuff together? I forgot. Get your gloves. I forgot. I forgot, I forgot. So these wet spots don't stay like you got it, right? You said? Yeah. Okay. Is there any way you could just get that off the smooth just some kind of way? Final glass, and then we'll start the veining. To a gray table. Hmm. Not after a jar. Yes. Oh. Okay. No, I just washed oh. it again. That's what I said. You are supposed to dab. You already dab that other spot over there? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, y'all, we have come to the end of this video. I really hope you all enjoyed this video because I really did enjoy recording it for you all. Y'all, this is the final look of this step. I will be back with part two, and I think there's a part three to this video and show you all the outcome. So look, listen, until next time, until the next video, bye-bye.